Yes, it's true, I'm leaving YouTube, but before we talk about that, I gotta move to another country. Hey man, how's it going? Thanks, my man. Thank you. <laughs> cheers, cheers. Goodbye, Cape Town. It's kind of sad. Thanks very much. Nah, fuck it. I already got enough stuff. <laughs> Please proceed to gate three immediately. Awesome. Thank you. Who can guess where I'm flying to? We have arrived. Okay, let me give you some tips on where I am. It is warm, it is an island. I've been here before and there are tons of digital nomads and creators. If you don't know now, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> Yes, 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 guys. I moved to Bali in Indonesia. Why did I leave South Africa? Honestly, I really, really enjoyed my time there. It was super cool also to live together with my two flatmates, Gabriel and Maxi. But yeah, I just like to change things up and I really enjoy to be able to live this digital nomads lifestyle and to be able to work from anywhere in the world. And that's why I kind of decided for myself that I want to switch countries around every six months. And yeah, this one is going to be Bali. I'm gonna stay here for the next sort of like four to five months, I guess. So far, it's been really, really cool. I moved here into this insanely beautiful villa together with my friend Matthias, who I actually also met in South Africa. I got myself a really, really nice motorbike. So that's super, super cool. But besides that, for the last week, I also spent a lot of time here behind my screen working on the new video. And yeah, you just really seem to enjoy it. Um, I lived for seven days as if they were my last. If you didn't check out the video yet, you can find it here. And yeah, there were just so many really kind and genuine comments. And yeah, I just really appreciate the support that you show me. And I just love where this community is heading because everybody just supports each other, which I love to see. And besides the video, I actually also got a ton of Instagram DMs from you guys when it comes to my new products for my own online shop, my text motion graphics, and also my anime film frames you guys really said that you love them that they help you out in your workflow and that they basically just speed up your process which I love to hear because honestly I've been spending so so much time on these products I also spend a lot of money on developing them like I just spent 7k on just developing the text motion graphics so I'm just super stoked to hear that you guys enjoy them and if you didn't check them out already you're going to find a link in the description all right, now let's actually get into the more serious part of this video. As you see it in the title, I am going to leave YouTube for an undefined amount of time. It can be three or four months. It can be also five or six months. I don't know it 100%, but for the next few months, I'm not going to post any videos on this YouTube channel. And you might ask yourself, why would you do that? Your channel is going great. It's growing super quickly and everybody loves your videos. And all of those things are true. And I love creating YouTube videos. Don't get me wrong, but there is a big reason why I do this and that reason is that I am going to create an online course about storytelling and filmmaking because I just feel like those two skills combined give you an immense power and it gives you the ability to impact other people's lives just like I try to do it with my own videos so you might ask yourself why not just create some YouTube videos and develop the online course at the same time and honestly that was my original approach but I just quickly found out that this is impossible I just feel like for the last one or two years I've been working five full-time jobs at the same time I know sometimes with these YouTube videos it may not look like it but there is so so much work that goes into creating these videos and at the same time I also have my online shop my email newsletter and some other things as well and yeah I just feel like I have made too many sacrifices in my personal life to keep all of this going and at the same time I just feel like having 10 balls in the air at the same time really holds me back from doing some really deep and creative work because 
there's always something else I have to take care of. And that's why I just wanted to focus on building my whole business and this YouTube channel a lot more sustainable because I want to do this for a lot of years to come and I don't want to burn myself out over and over again. And at some point I just lose my passion. So that's why, yeah, I just decided to take a break from YouTube and focus 100% on creating the best possible online course. So yeah, it's a little bit sad, but at the same time, I think that it is the right decision to make and I just became a lot more comfortable with going this step and honestly, I'm just freaking excited about starting this new chapter of my life and just facing this completely new challenge of developing an online course. That's still going to be a lot of work, but I know that if I spend a lot of time focused on that one project, then it's going to be at the quality which I really want to have because I truly want to teach you guys to become the best storytellers that are out there and yeah in order to really make that happen in order to make the online course as good as possible I decided to hire two people to join my team they're going to work full-time with me one of them is Patrick and the other one is Jack they're going to help me edit they help me organize everything and actually I decided to fly them out here to Bali in order to really work together as a team to work face to face they're going to come by the beginning of July and I'm going to rent out a villa for us where we can shoot where we can work together creatively and I'm just super super stoked to actually like build a team and to work on a big project together with them. So is there any way for you guys to still get updates on my life and on what's happening with the online course? And yes, there is because I'm still going to be active on Instagram. I'm going to post stories and also posts. And yeah, I just really want to share some behind the scenes insights into like, what we're doing with the online course. I'm going to ask you questions. I really want you to be a part of building that online course as well. Yeah, that's why I think it really makes sense to head over to my Instagram channel and uh, to follow me there um, because that's where a lot of stuff is going to happen in the next few months. I'm also going to post sometimes in YouTube community to give you updates as well, but I'm not going to create these big videos that I used to do before. And also I want to do another community meetup here in Bali because I just really enjoyed the last community meetup in Cape Town in my apartment because yeah, I felt like it was just the perfect place for all of us creators and all of us like-minded people to connect with each other, to share our passions and also, yeah, basically just to build relationships for the months to come. So definitely want to do that more more often and in order to like know when these are going to happen it also makes sense to either follow on Instagram or just stay tuned on YouTube community yeah that is basically everything I just felt like I want to let you know what's happening in my life at the moment and that a new big chapter is starting in my life and I am extremely extremely grateful for the immense support that you've showed me over the last two years I wouldn't be able to do any of this if it wasn't for you guys and yeah I guess I'm just going to see you in a few months and I'm already missing you. <laughs> see you soon. Bye.